Hi there, Madeline. Chris Marshall here from River City Hyundai here to show you the 2010 Veracruz that I have in stock for you. So this is the one that I was talking about. That's the Santa Fe, just the name change. So very, very nice car. As you can see, it's been very well kept. I'm just going to do a quick walk around to the outside before I explain all the features to you. So this one is an all-wheel drive limited edition. So I'll start under the hood for you. Under the hood here, you obviously have your V6 engine, so all that nice snap and passing power on the highway without compromising too much fuel economy. You got dual hydraulics, so very easy to open and close this hood. And a nice little safety feature, not that your engine ever will catch on fire, but should it ever catch on fire, these black pins up here are going to melt, and this is actually a fire blanket that's going to come down and smother the flames, as well as fire barrier in the back. So with these ones here, you got the LED headlights, so they're also encased in a very durable coating. Don't have to worry about rocks popping up and breaking those. Fog, lamp, fog lamps down below to help you see about 15 meters further in the dark. Along the side here, you've got illuminated side mirrors. And these are breakaways, so they'll go either way without breaking. Difference between a $5 fix and a $500 fix. These ones are also heated. I don't know if you can see the symbol there, but it's nice to have in the winters here. Something cool with this one is it actually does have the proximity lock. So if you have the key in your hand, simple as pressing the button, open or unlock and lock the door, sorry. On the inside of the door panel, you'll notice this thing has a really nice trim on it. So nice orange leather inlays with wood grain, power windows, power locks, power mirrors, memory seat settings, Power adjustable leather seat. As you can see, it's a nice brown textured leather. It goes really well with the rest of the interior of the car. So, with this one here, you do have power foot pedals, or power adjustable foot pedals, sorry. You got the all wheel drive lock on there. Volume controls directly on the steering wheel. With this, you have a full multimedia system. So, you got, um, sorry, USB, auxiliary. Satellite radio, CD, all the good stuff that you would ever need. Now this I think is kind of neat. The key fob, just like this, right into the blue button. Then you got the telescopic steering wheel that goes into place. And as you can see, only 100,000 kilometers on here. So with this one here, obviously it's fully loaded, so you got the heated seats, your side, press this button, all your multimedia hookups, you got a nice little storage, or not storage, sorry, ashtray there, the nice storage right here. Cup holders down there, a little bit of storage up above, and great big storage down below. This one comes with the Infinity upgraded sound system as well. And a nice sunroof in the back of the vehicle here. So in the back you can see that the seats do fold down all the way. It gives you a nice open open back. DVD just like I explained over the phone there. So you got a nice little DVD that comes down as well. That'll be handy for the kids once they grow up. You got power outlets in the back as well. Oh, and sorry, I forgot to point out with this. Climate control, the full climate control settings for them, as well as the DVD. back of the vehicle here. It also has dual chrome tip exhaust, so a nice sporty look to it. You got parking sensors to help you back up. And this one, as you can see, power lift gate. You just have to press the button to open it. And then there's another button right here to close it. So 
All in all, Madeline, a really great car for a really great price and really low kilometers for the year. So please do let me know your thoughts of this one. I will be sending you the video of the 14 as soon as it's done being polished. But other than that, I hope you have a great day and I'll be in touch with you shortly. Take care.